Let us continue our discussion of search algorithms. We are going to look at a more efficient search algorithm called binary search algorithm. Not to be confused with binary search tree, which is a data structure. This is a really good website that shows how binary search works. Let's walk through the working of binary search before we write code for it. In this example array, we have 32 elements. Let's see how many steps will it take to find the last element in the array. Remember that with linear search, it will take approximately 32 steps to find the last element. Before we go any further, take a minute to see if you can spot something different about this array. This array is sorted in ascending order. This means that the number on the left is always going to be smaller than the number on the right. This is a very important point to remember. We will come back to this point after we've seen how binary search works.